Hey Bible lovers, I'm Tim Nichols and I'm here to bring you your Worth. and today we are featuring the Adventure Bible for the first time in the NASB 1995, which is a testament to the popularity of this translation. They're putting the number one selling children's Bible in this translation. Previously it's been released in the NIV and the NIRV, which is the New International Reader's Bible, which is designed for a more of an early reader. This is actually a little bit more of an advanced reading, which I think is awesome that they are using a little bit more of a word-for-word -word translation in a children's Bible. So just a few of the features. Number one, it has a Life in the Bible Times, which are articles and illustrations that, de that describe what life was like in ancient days. It's Words to Treasure, which is different memory verses for kids. A Did You Know section, which is interesting facts to help you understand God's Word, the life of faith. People in Bible Times live it, which is like a hands-on lesson that helps kids kind of engage in the scripture. It has 20 jungle-themed Bible topics that are on full-color pages. And you will notice in this one, I love that it has a matte finish. These kind of have the shiny finish on them, but this has a matte finish and the animals are kind of glossy, which I think is really cool. It does have the comfort print font for the NASB and it is a 9.5 font. Now, one thing you will notice is this is full color. All the updated editions are full color. These older editions are not full color. They kind of just have a green tint to them. But you will notice when you get into this one, check it out. Full color all the way through. Nice bold colors all through the table of contents. And just everything about this thing just screams color, life, adventure, fun. It has a jungle theme, which I thought was really, really cool. And the book introductions, check it out. The book introductions give you who wrote the book, why was the book written, what do we learn about God in this book, who are the key people in this book, when did it happen, where did it happen, and then it gives you some key uh, people and stories throughout the text. Uh, it highlights Joseph, Adam, and Eve, of course, in the book of Genesis. As you get into it, you see the 9.5 font. That does look a little smaller than a 9.5 font to me, but the comfort print does make it easy to read. You will notice the little parrot in the Did You Know section is in full color. You will notice that the Live It section is in full color and the words to treasure are in full color. And again, this kind of functions like a study Bible in a way for a child. And again, in the NASB 1995, I think that's a good move because for those who like your more traditional and word-for-word -word renderings, this would help parents to be more likely to engage in a children's Bible. So all throughout it, you're going to see these same themes. I love that they have the blue headings for the page in the book, and I also like the green for the chapter numbers and the subtopics. It does have some limited footnotes, and again, a full page, jungle theme, Ten Commandments, um, Bible verses to read when you feel alone, lonely, sad. This is just really, really neat tool for kids. And it's the number one selling study Bible for a reason, or the number one selling children's Bible for a reason. Then when you get to the back, check it out. It has a dictionary concordance. So if they find some difficult words that they want to try to learn on their own, they have that tool as well. And then, of course, you have your Zondervan maps at the end. So this thing has the full gamut. This Bible does not cheat. It gives you all the aspects of a great translation in NASB 1995, and it gives you all the stuff you're used to in your Adventure Bible in a more word-for-word -word translation. This thing is only about $21 right now if you get it on sale at Christian Book. I'll post a link to that in the description. Meanwhile, I really like this thing. I think it's really useful, and if you have kids, this would be a great way to get them engaged in God's Word. Anyhow, there you have it. Keep calm. Jesus on. This is your Nicholas Word.